Hello and welcome to my channel. This is 69 in Sync and I am here to do your Taco Tuesday reading. Now this is fairly, fairly new, you all. No sweet girl doesn't sit there. Um, and I am coming up, I have come up with something very new. So what I will be doing is pulling, I mean, doing a roller dice reading. What? Boom, 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 boom. Who, got, who we got next in the Zodiac crew? Oh, look like we got Sagittarius. Sagittarius in the building. Let's get it. I'm going to pull the general energy of the person on your mind, Sagittarius. Spirit, can we get the person on Sagittarius's mind and their general energy currently? Oh, I like what almost popped out. You know, I got the big deck. So I'd be having to like pick it up like all oh, crazy. Let's see. What kind of thank you, Spirit? Strength. Strength keeps coming out for everybody, okay? Everybody's needing to be in some strength right now. <laughs> Let's see what's at the bottom of the deck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six of Pentacles. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So the person on your mind, Sagittarius, could be moving towards some type of um, calmer situation, Yay! okay? Or some type of relaxing situation. I do notice the moon at the bottom of the deck, okay? Um they could be getting a lot of new communication or information being brought to them at this time. So uh, maybe like opportunities, all right, when it comes to like maybe even moving from their current situation or maybe even changing jobs or something like that I'm getting. Yeah, okay, this is all, this all came out. I usually don't just show this because I didn't really ask spirit just yet, but I see the Two of Cups, the Page of Swords, and the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, some new opportunity is coming in from them for them really good really good energy i like this person on your mind okay and then i also saw the empress at the bottom of the deck this could be an empress okay or somebody who's um very nurturing all right the person on your mind uh sagittarius how do they feel about you let's see spirit three cards please for Ooh, ooh, something fell, something fell. Oh, two things fell. all right y'all my bonus card came out so this is good this is a good reading <coughs> excuse me my ear wands, my um, that's my special card, right? <coughs> Justice came out right with the eight of wands, you know, eight of wands having your way in a situation, and Justice is just clarifying it, really. <laughs> I love that for you guys. You guys got a bonus. Queen of Cups, I'm not sure who the Queen of Cups is, all right? You could be this Queen of Cups, or you could be thinking about the Queen of Cups, but oh, oh yeah, this is how they feel about you. Okay, so yeah, they see you as the Queen of Cups. All right, you could just be emotionally stable. It is not gender specific, but I see them holding a lot of strength because they're ready to move um, in a serious direct. I mean, not in a serious, I keep saying serious, y'all. But I mean, like, in a more uh, stable, I say stable too, y'all. I'm trying to figure out some more words. Y'all know I'm <laughs> I'm getting with it, all right? I, I'm, I'm trying to switch up my vocabulary. I don't want to, like, make it feel like I'm reading the same readings, you know? And all of these are different in unique ways. Let's get one more spirit for our Saggies and the person on their mind. How they feel about the Saggies. Let's see. Nine of Cups. Okay, yeah, they have great Yay! energy towards you. They feel like you're successful. You're on your way. You're doing your thing. They're, you're patient. Okay, I like this. This person really views you as somebody who is standing in their power. Like somebody who is really just not giving up here with the Nine of Wands under the temperance here under the deck. You guys are definitely getting it what it is that you want. You guys are emotionally stable. You guys are holding it together. Like, getting everything done here, okay? You guys are, like, to them, you guys are, like, wifey material, hubby material, okay? They could even be trying to find the strength to move towards you, okay? Because they do see all these great qualities in you, Saggy. All right, let's just keep it moving and let's move on to... How you feel about this person that is on your mind, Saggies? Let's see, spirit. Person on Saggies mind. Can we get oops, three cards? My my <laughs> my magic card came back out. Yeah, it didn't do this for none of my readings. All right, we're gonna we're gonna always pull a card on top of that one, okay? Because it is one of my special cards in the deck, so it always usually pops out the most, right? Because it's a little the way it is. But let's see, uh, three more cards, please, please, Spirit, for Saggies and how they feel about the person on their mind currently. The Hermit. 
It's right on top of the Eight of Wands. <clears throat> All right. How does the Sagi feel about the person in my spirit? The moon. All right. One more card. Thank you, spirit. The wheel of fortune. You're feeling like, oh, I like this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Six of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, you guys. Okay, so Six of Pentacles, Hermit with the Eight of Wands. Okay, so Hermit with the Eight of Wands. You guys are seeing this person as somebody who likes to just stay grounded and do what it is that they need to do to get it done as well. So maybe they match your energy when it comes to that, Saggy. Yeah, you guys both are getting what it is that you want. And remember, this is this was the first card that came out for uh, how you, they feel about you as well. So you're feeling like they're getting everything that they want, and but they're kind of staying to themselves about it. They're kind of like maybe out of the public eye. They kind of meditate on what it is that they want. You know, they kind of just um, kind of communicate, you know. I, I would say this person is a night owl okay they could work at night but i see the will of fortune here when it comes to you know maybe you all's connection hey step back baby you got a book you got a book get a book baby read a book okay so the will of fortune the will of fortune is here and um and um sorry about that guys and the Wheel of Fortune is here. And it's really like... You have the opportunity to create whatever whatever relationship you want with this person. You There is a give and take here. You guys are investing into each other, either currently or you may even work together or something like that. But I see that there is a good investment being made here. And I believe that like the way that i'm feeling right now saggy like this is really good for you guys like it really is uh it's a give and take situation if some of you guys are 50 50 with a person this is that situation so i don't i don't whoever is on your mind right now like i really hope it resonates with you because this person is willing to give into you and you're willing to give into this person let's see what's under the six you have the strength as well see they have the strength you have the strength both of you guys can come together and make it happen here with the will of fortune both of you guys can be the sun, okay? The sun. Like, I, I can't make this up, guys. I cannot make this up, all right? These are the two cards that was right on top of, you know, each other. The sun card comes out next, okay? You're thinking logically about this situation, but for the most part, that is your happiness, okay? The person on your mind, you're, you're thinking about, they want you, you want them. Make that, make it happen, baby. I like it. I love this energy for you all, Saddies. But I hope that this resonated with you guys. If it did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, peace.